Hey guys, it's Fortnite here. Uh, welcome to another episode of Metal Black Theater. And I am again here with Trevor. This is episode 3. So let's get started. <laughs> what? <laughs> Okay. It's just so ridiculous. If you press an old Y, you explode. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, it smells like beef stew in here. It's making me sick and hungry at the same time. Yeah, let me do this. Be careful. Prison it now. The food is not cheap. I tried to punch the thing. There you go, there's not a gem, by the way. Up there. Yo, no! What is that water? Poison? It doesn't matter, it's all the same. It all does the same. Oh. I can't get out there! Alright. Stop it. Oh, oh. 
Yeah, he did, but we're both playing on my computer. Yep. Yeah. Shoot. <laughs> I, I feel like there's gonna be something bad in there. Nope. Yeah. 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah. Okay. I need to take that one. No. No, no, no. no. You stay there, and then I come over here, climb this up. Okay, good go. I hope there was only six for this stage. How many, like, areas are there? I know, oh, we didn't get everyone. No. We failed at our goal. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> oh, that killed me. I can. I've had a few times. I've also had a lot of 
prisony place with its perilous medley of twisted stage productions that shred the silky fabric which weaves together the fragile blanket of sanity that keeps us sane. But you know, whatever. Either way, it's safe to say we're in quite a pickle jar here. We gotta rescue our friends and get back to Mr. Boat. I mean, they do the same for you. An adventuring just wouldn't be the same without, I don't know, this guy. Best chef in all the land. Food so stupid delicious one taste would blow your face through the back of your head. Like bang, splat! And who could forget this quirky fellow? You know, he owns a bat farm back home, and his lifelong dream is to breed a terrifying race of super bats. None of which makes any sense, of course, because he's absolutely terrified of bats. And this lovely ass always tells the best bedtime stories, hands down. Plus, she always smells like chocolate, so that's good. And then there's this guy, and this handsome fellow, and that thing. There's all your best friends imprisoned, and they don't like it very much because it's bad and horrible. And then there's Hattie, the best friend of all. Why did he stab us in the back and twist the blade? I mean, just this morning, he gave everybody flowers and presents, and now he goes out of his way to hurt our feelings? Oh, I think not. You can't fool me. Hattie would never betray us. B betray us? Never! Something fishy's going on here, and I think I don't like it right now at all. It must have something to do with that scary, albeit fashionable hat. Or looks evil. I mean, it's glowing red and stuff. Glowing red stuff is always bad. Every Everybody knows that. So what dangerous treats lie in store as we continue to unravel this treacherous sweater? I don't know, but use caution as you continue your talent endeavor. Don't like fail and die and stuff, cause it's all up to you now! What? Why did why did you do that? So scary. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, we will be recording another episode. I can't speak to uh, we will be recording another episode very soon, so um, please like and favorite this video and comment any suggestions of what you want to do in the future. So, thank you so much, and I will see you later. Bye-bye!